Max Clark off to. He's being hurried by Stefan Levis. Levis gets there. And then Dombra knocked off the ball, but the ball was loose and Marchant. Little sprint for the line with Fokker singing. He's going to need help. He's got it in Lorde, who can find care, who roared on by 4,000, can enjoy the last 15 minutes to the line. And celebrate with his mates who are all back inside again. Well, Max Clark is receiving some treatment down in the Quinn's half. He must be thinking, what have I done wrong there to deserve getting out the seat? Danny Kerr under the post. He makes a beautiful break on the outside, but there's just no one there with him. No support there in time, and he runs away from his support. Look at that, five Quinn's players around him, and he's just turned over. Don Brandt tries to get in there. Nothing wrong there. Ball squirts out the side, and Joe Marchant, you've got to say, does beautifully well just to stand up, thock and a singer, and then look for the support on the inside. But it all came from this mistake at the breakdown. Just needed to buy a fraction more time, didn't he? Max Clark after making that wonderful break and Quinn's profit. Well, it's two tries from Harlequins and two from their defence, and that's what will be most pleasing. Once from their scrum and second from Stefan Levy's working double hard, and then that transition from defence into attack.